Do not ignore the passion that burns in you, spend time to discover your gift. Do not ignore your gift, your gift is the thing you do the absolute best, with the least amount of effort. Don't hate the player, change the game. Don't let your mind stop you. If you can see it in your mind, you can hold it in your mind. Let a man see what he can get, but make him imagine what he can have. My father instilled in me to take care of my family, show up even when you don't want to show up. Wake up and smile. Wake up and be grateful. Excuses are the lies, you convince yourself are true to avoid proving, you are worthy of the gift you were given. Say this with me, no more excuses. Growth is in a series of mistakes, that's the only way you learn. I was homeless. I lived in a car for a couple of years. That was the worst. But nothing was worse than when I was 40 and my mom passed away. My mother was the best person I ever knew. I'm a comedian first. I've learned how to act. I just draw on life experiences and that's how I learned. I didn't take classes or anything. I don't need a classroom. Your setback is just a setup for a comeback. You can't go forward and backward, at the same time. The dream is free, but the hustle is sold separately. Your reality is yours. Stop wasting time looking at someone else's reality, while doing nothing about yours. What would you do? If you weren't afraid. The number one cause of failure in this country is, the fear of failure. Your gift is something that, you can do innately better than anything else. What I learned from that moment is that when you face your fears, they aren't as big as you thought they were. What makes them big is when you don't turn around to face them head on. The longer you avoid your fears, the bigger they grow in your mind. Failure means, you've now learned another valuable lesson, that pushes you one step closer to success. I pay attention, to every minute of the day. Procrastination will delay your change. Today is a very good day to change. Don't let you stop yourself from growing. Men produce strategies for success. A person has to remember that, the road to success is always under construction. You have to get that through your head. That it is not easy becoming successful. Successful people appreciate where they have come from, but they don't let their past set the tone for their future. Successful people are innovators. You can't tell big dreams to small-minded people. Some of us have been playing the same self-defeating records, over and over again in our heads for so long that, we don't know, how to think any differently about ourselves. The four P's to success are pressure, persistence, perseverance, and prayer. Don't ever be afraid, to put yourself in a lesser position, so that you can learn something from someone, who knows more. Success is not just about your ability to achieve, but also your ability to serve through sharing. True success lives in our legacies. Your dream has to be bigger than your fear. When you're happy at home, you can make a lot of things happen. The more people you help become successful, the more successful you become. If you want to be successful, you have to jump, there's no way around it. When you jump, I can assure you that your parachute will not open right away. But if you do not jump, your parachute will never open. If you're safe, you'll never soar. You have the potential for greatness. Sometimes out of your biggest misery, comes your greatest gain. You are never too old, to reinvent yourself. The most successful people in this world recognize that, taking chances to get what they want is much more productive, than sitting around being too scared, to take a shot. Find that one, glimmer of light in the darkness. God's plan for you is greater than any plan, you can think of. If you don't have a base, you can't have a spiritual base and survive. That's probably, what has kept me out of the tabloids. Then I go home, I've got a family, and I keep my wife in front of my head. Prayer changes things. God doesn't make any mistakes. You are exactly, where you are supposed to be right now. If you pray about it, don't worry about it. If you're going to worry about it, don't pray about it. 